audio on demand from Vision Christian Media. Want to win in life's challenges? To know the will of God and have more passion for Him? Practical help right now with Tark Barna and Running With Fire. We read in Mark chapter 8, 36 to 37, what will it profit a man if he gains the world and loses his own soul? And have you ever stopped to think how valuable you are to God? How valuable the person next to you is to God, your neighbors, the man on the street? Jesus is saying if a man gives his soul and gets all the wealth in the world, he gets every BMW, every private jet, every yacht, every gold mine, every diamond, every jewel, every house in the street. If he gets all the money in the world, he's in exchange for his soul, he has made a bad deal because he is worth more than that. Do you know what the gross product of the world, the GDP of the world is? It's estimated about $156 trillion. I can't even put my head around that. Um, but Jesus said if a man gives himself in exchange for $156 trillion, he's made a bad deal because he is worth more than that. Next time you see someone in the street, shop counter, at work, a homeless person, I want you to think how valuable are they in God's eyes? Because the truth is they're worth more than your house. They're worth more than all the houses on your street. They're worth more than all the wealthiest companies in the world. The reality is that person is worth more than all the wealth in the world. So, how can we work out the value of an individual? How valuable are you? What are you actually worth? Well, the answer is actually simple, John 3.16. For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son. Your value equals the value of Jesus because that's the price that was paid for your salvation. You know, when you make a purchase, you never pay more, well, you shouldn't, more than it's worth. So you see a car, uh, it's worth $5,000. You're not going to pay $10,000 for it, are you? No, no, you pay what it's worth. God also won't pay more than what something is worth. So what he gave in order to purchase you, if you're the only person in the world that needed to be saved, the price Jesus, God paid for you, was the price of Jesus. Now, what is Jesus worth? Well, there's no value you can put on that. So your value, the person on the street's value, is equal to that of the value of Jesus, the Son of God. You are of infinite value. And, the, and God wants you to see how valuable you are. We talked last week. End of last week, I think it was, about the, the, the Samaritan woman in John 4, verse 4 to 7. But he needed, Jesus needed to go through Samaria. So he came to a city of Samaria, which is called Sychar, near the plot of ground that Jacob gave to his son Joseph. Now Jacob's well was there. Jesus, therefore, being weary from his journey, sat by the well. It was about the sixth hour, a woman of Samaria came to draw water. Jesus said to her, give me to drink. For you have had five, hus-, verse 18, you've had five husbands, and the one you are with now is not your husband. In that you spoke truly. Now just watch this for a few moments. Jesus is tired and he goes out of his way to reach out to a woman. Samaritan woman who would have been an outcast of society. Would have been despised and looked down upon. And Jesus goes out of his way to minister to one woman considered, I suggest, worthless by society. Wow. Jesus is an amazing person. And it just shows us Jesus' love for and value of one individual, whether they're at the top of society or whether they're at the bottom of society. It makes no difference to Jesus. Everyone is of equal value and equal worth. When we really realize the value that God puts on one human being, will never take for granted an encounter with any person on earth we ever meet. And we will slowly learn to treat every human being with the greatest of care, knowing that their true worth is of infinite value. And you are also of infinite value. That's the price tag Jesus puts on you the life of his very own self. Jesus went to the cross just for you because you're worth it. 
Park Barna is the Senior Pastor of Church Unlimited in Auckland, New Zealand. For more information, to make contact or to listen again, look for Running With Fire at our website, vision.org.au. Thanks for taking time to listen to this audio on demand from Vision Christian Media. To find out more about us, go to vision.org.au. 